What's good, y'all? Roly Roll back. My name is Roly Roll. Back with Cyberpunk Act 2. You know, it's part 7. 7 or 6? 7, yeah, 7. <laughs> I'm bugging, right? Yo, let's get this, man. Let's get this money, man. Let's start this up. Shit was crazy last time. But this time, we got... There we go. All right. That's crazy. That's how you you spend money. You can spend your own money. Is this the email? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> when you drink, you get um, you get messed up. Is this the email? Rent pass through. Oh, they about the dumbass out. Naked boy, your boy, naked boy, your boy, naked boy. I'm trying to do this right. Tajemura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? <laughs> if you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Well, your ass gonna wait for a long ass time, my brother. Oh shit, not good. Ah, oh, come on. Kill me, NCPD, open up. I always want to mess with somebody. Oh, do I really need this? Uh, increase weapon attack speed, increase critical hit damage, increase critical chance. Me all that. No problem. Got some balls with a fellow. Go get him, Tiger. Let me see what jobs. So this one is him, but. I got a lot of missions to do, man. WNS News. Today is a sad one in our city's history. Mayor Lucius Ryan has passed away. We learned of Mayor Ryan's death from his family. He died peacefully in his sleep. 
The exact cause of his death has not been released, but initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. They killed that boy. They killed the mayor boy. Today, we all mourn the My name is Rodeo. So, it's a new one. No, I ain't got time for this. Why does she sound? Oh, I read it. She sound. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, no biggie. Not like that cyber psycho was a tank on two chrome legs. Oh, I'm about to steal a car, son. Huh? Oh! They don't even stop. They just run your ass over. Damn. I'm about to take over. No! Not me! Not me! Shut the up. Hey, how do I... Damn, how do you change the, the camera? This... Oh, alright. Yeah, my little dude buggy. That's what <laughs> I thought it was like GTA when you, when you stop and you bring in front of them and they stop. And they don't do that. Yo, Rise, um, the gameplay good? Or is it like a little choppy? Ooh, I'm about to get a little car. I'm about to get a little car. This shit wavy. I bet, bet, bet. Lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our right, accounts. This, this your type of Cassandra call. Dorset. You did quite well. Hello, do you buddy. and that friend I'm gonna get, That's what I'm going to get you for Christmas. Until then. You know what's crazy? You, you, see, you hear the music that's on right now? That's the music this, this dude Matt was playing. When we, um. <laughs> that's the music Matt was playing, sir. When we was. Oh, why are you calling? I heard you home. What the fuck? Already. You sure got that ear to the ground. Oh, that's, that's the guy. Yeah. Siempre. Anyway, you need something. Tell me what to do, bro. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. 
Evelyn. What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. It's a fact. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Don't think so, no. Can you expand? Don't matter how much perfume Macorpo sprays on mornings. By lunch, that's replaced by the stench of skullduggery. Only thing I caught from Evelyn was determination. And I too stink of skullduggery? No, nope. you're starting to stink. Period. Mm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. They're talking about this and shit. you think yeah, damn. they'll trust the word of a merc. I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip. The relic is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Of the NUSA and Militech. Hanako-sama, oai tekete koei desu. Kochira koso. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. <laughs> Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. I just shoot this thing. And you just shoot him. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. I'll get back to you. I need time to plan. Organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. 
Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Paka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The woman is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Oh, Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. The fuck? Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. <laughs> hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. <laughs> Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogel danced any tune I play, or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. My baby. Saw you were dead. Oh. What the fuck? I'm not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. You heard about the heist, I take it. Sure. You must Uh, 
Oh, you press B to slide. All right, hey, it. haven't I seen you here before? Mox. Got a good memory for faces. How uh, you doing? Bar's closed. Sorry, Chief. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Whoa, whoa. Start again. What is it you wanted to do? Beat some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I Going. Nothing to see back here. Oh, shut that up. You're done with that. Watson's old dairy. I'm. Yep. Back to the bump and grind. Stop telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You're so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh, yeah, we fucking are. Don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. What was that all about? And either you fly high oh, shit. or sink into quicksand. Yeah, I skipped to the back soon. What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? You need to talk to her. Oh, she's so beautiful. Look at her. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your doom bus killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself, too. Boo-hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Murks. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writings on your face. Okay, let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip we clipped during the heist is killing me. Albeit slowly. Evie commissioned the job. I know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. Let's say I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. Where is that? Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Awesome, beautiful. You still need something? Wait, mean to say she's a doll? Wait. Um, just let me know how she's doing. Okay. I'll give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Club's closed. Don't 
you have somewhere to be? You know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. You might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. And Susie anyone Q. not a mox is not my damn problem. Oh, wait, so Forget it's... Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Mwah. <laughs> I need a damn car. Bro. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No, pleased to meet you. Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Him. this guy trust him many times we have had the opportunity to kill Papa. yes i trust him fine where's the meat and when japan town after sunset i am sending you the precise location i'll see you there I don't think I'm gonna give away this motorcycle. I like it. Oh my god. NUSA! Stop! Hey, this is my crib. Wrong oh, button. Good price on everything. So, you broke even? Yes. I the up. goods were trash. I would have thrown them away. It's happened. It's happened. Oh, because they asked me. I don't know why it's made me grab him. See, the only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. If I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain Dad's chick is hiding something. No coincidence, we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Someone's in a great mood. 
Not every day a half brain dead dude drags me around a cat house in a wild horde chase. So I'm having a grand old time. I need Judy. Ah, oh, shit. So hold on. You take the blow up dog, dream all the whole, and, and that's cheap. That's infidelity. Uh, no. What the fuck? Well. How's that any different from some dollhouse ass? Oh, wait. Because the ass is big. You can skip. You can change the females. I'm crying. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would what you up? care to jack into the terminal? Oh, I'm looking for that. Jack in, please. How could you possibly know what I'm looking for? Clouds always knows. Your deepest desire, we find it. You'll have your needs fulfilled. And maybe much more. Less is not a word we use around here. I need it. I need to get my shit up there. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Interesting. Is that normal or? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? They go with. I couldn't have chosen. There you go. The entire floor sky away disconnect. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Only two willing to Please spread their legs. Please deposit any and all you. hazardous items. Sad. With me. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Oh, hey, baby. Hi. I'm Sky, and you must be Vincent. Welp, looks like this will be interesting. Let's <laughs> see. So, V, you're dying. How'd you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this, cower before it. So, what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Think you know me well? Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. 
I'm about to have this conversation with you. Ah, a hard shell for everyone to see. You think even thinking about it undermines you, makes you soft. Don't survive in Night City by being weak. Fear isn't a weakness. It's there to protect you. From what? Losing myself? Becoming a stranger in my own body? You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Death is death is death. You're gone, game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it, and it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since, or for what's to come. What I've been through, tough to move on from that. That's a damn something that session, happened to bro. other people. Hell that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. So what now? Now. You find out what it is you need to do. Which is... You're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop She's you. She's giving this my, my boy V life lessons, bruh. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. Oh my god, all right. I'm being tired of your shit. Him back. <gasps> oh my god. Not a single thing in this world is in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you got a kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Whoa. Goddamn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake. Ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you, Vargin, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the ship. First, tell me what you know about Evelyn. Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. 
Oh, these, they, they, be, they be real. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Stupid. <laughs> That's crazy. Not bad. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here. Now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. Oh. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Technical ability. Ah, so back upstairs. In a minute. Need to piss first. What will you have? Yeah, I know that bike. I know it. Hard day? More like hard life. You better keep this short and sweet. Two. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Oh god. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Sure you need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Yeah, Except it's off there. limits to customers. Motorcycle, not motor. Woodman, who is he? Has a motor. Uh, Mr. Forrest. Really? But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. I know where to... Mm -mm.
I'm, I'm gonna try to do this shit first so I can get this shit out of the way. You go full so open this shit? Shit's in it though. Must have left in a hurry. Right. I had this office, but I feel like I gotta get stuff. Second, power bullets rings off. Can I ricochet off surfaces? Can be recharged or release a powerful shot. I think I might need that. Bro, yeah. no clients allowed in here. Be a chum and close the door on your way out, would ya? As you can see, I'm Over very busy. Way. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you can do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. I mean... You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy your horse here, not snitches. I look like either of those to you. How to look the menu here and know. You don't look a thing like these meat puppets. More like a Joy Boy's cum rag. You insolent fuck. <laughs> Shit. 
sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Shits is what? Shits I gotta take over, I think. Yeah. Uh. 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 
this? E9. How's that? How did it feel? I'm required to return your weapon. I just work here. I'm about to shoot in our fucking head too. I, I got too much shit. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? That's it for them. I think Fingers got her. I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Hurt me! No, I can't you. condition to find helmet. said so yourself made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind want you to live now asked you already what the hell you want from me I got a get out of jail free card I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage see me and Arasaka we got a half century old score neat settling and I plan to do it that's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel Listen, kind of honored, I actually. know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so, this Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Damn, I should ask more questions. Following so far? Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Come on, come on. You got more to say, so just say it. Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. that the damn Bet it still is today. To the damn Telling you, fish. all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arisaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, Bomb's named Alta Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, 
We got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. This number is temporarily unavailable. Please leave a message. So, you're never gonna guess what happened. Dex put a hit on me. I took a bullet, I died, I came back. All good until I realized I had a time bomb wedged in my brain. Feels like a goddamn movie plot. Got no idea what happened to you. Where you are, but... Hang tough, Mano. Oh, right. And I met Johnny Silverhand. Long story. Doubt you two get along. You always could smell bullshit a mile off. Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? If you are looking for a taste of paradise... Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock, goes by fingers. Oh shit. Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off of Jig Jig Street. Fuck me. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Oh, all right, later, V. Next stop, you're on your doorstep. Night. 